Think about how many years you've spent at your longest job you've had. A Jeffersonville employee just marked 50 years, and as Chris Suter shows us, his co-workers and city weren't about to just let that milestone pass by without any recognition. Here's tonight's WDRB positive. The thing about making a sign is not to rush yourself. Words. You would have to peel the letters off and stick it on there. Have always been his thing. Always kept a dictionary up here in the, in the list of the streets. Making street signs, though. Center Street. Only part of the gig. I did everything. I picked up garbage. I blacktopped. I painted lines. It's not an easy job. He's built tough. I love to work in the snow, and the rain never bothered me. Uh, only the lightning. And he's been wearing the street department vest and hat for longer than any employee in Jeffersonville City history. I've never heard of anybody that I know of that's been somewhere 50 years. Meet Alan Fetter. They call me Alley Cat. <laughs> and don't ask how I got that name. You know I did. I was just in an alley one morning kissing a girl. And uh, a guy I worked with seen me in the alley. Just a little. <laughs> and I come into work that day and he said, your name's not Alan, it's Alley Cat. Oh my, the lucky gal? His bride. They were newlyweds back then. But the story is legend and the name stuck. <laughs> Somewhere through the laughs. I've never ever seen him mad. He laughs all the time. Alley Cat became. He's more than a, a co-worker to me. I'm a really good friend, almost like a father figure. There with advice or to offer those words he's so good with. We've become family, I feel, over the, over the years. He's shown everyone how to live a meaningful, hardworking life by example. And just be thankful for each day, and that's what I always was. And always will be. So when he decided marking five decades on the job was the sign he needed to call it a career. If I had good legs now, I'd still be <laughs> His people weren't about to let him walk away without the perfect send off. All right, good morning, everybody. Jeffersonville Mayor Mike Moore and Alley Cat's co workers. I wish that we could hire 35 Allen Petters. Doing the honors at a Board of Public Works meeting. We are going to be dedicating a, an alley in the city of Jeffersonville <laughs> right off Nahan Avenue. Alley Cat jumped back in that pickup truck. Listen to his oh, final goodbye over the radio. Thank you for 50 years of dedicated service. We love you. Your service is complete. And drove across town like he had so many times before. But watched this time. <laughs> As Alan Alley Cat Fetter Alley went up. Still got a little tear in there. But <laughs> that may happen when his co workers drive by in the days ahead, too. That's if they don't see Alley Cat back there doing what he did to earn his nickname in the first place. <laughs> I told my wife that. I said, I'm going to take you by there every day. <laughs> Smooching and laughing. <laughs> Not a bad way to spend retirement. In Jeffersonville, Chris Suter, WDRB News.